I still feel like I'm peeling off layers of protection all the time. I, I definitely feel like uh, at times I maybe live a bit of a double life because um, I definitely can come across very secure in who I am and know that this is the person that I am. But I'm privately, I can be very insecure and very, and always searching for um, what it is or who it is that I am. Okay, bye. My name is Loa. Loa, I thought it was one of the most beautiful words I've ever heard. They're kind of spirits um, in Haitian voodoo that embody different manifestations of the force of, of nature. And um, I wondered what would happen if you added a H, and I googled it. <laughs> in Cavalarian, it's the name given to females for a girl who's a musician or an artist and a poet, and I was like, okay, yoink. <laughs> If enough time goes by and I haven't been creating, I start feeling, I feel antsy and frustrated and I just feel the need to work. And if I don't work, um, the irritation just mounts and mounts and mounts. If you want to stay here, it is said you must dance. Hold your moment in It's not always easy to be fully honest, like lyrically I'll veil a lot of my meaning. Um, because I do find it hard to stand up in front of audiences and speak my direct, literal truth. And speak it because like, you know what, one day I'll be dead and gone and it'll just be the work that remains. And if, you know, it has to have meaning. Um, so if I'm just hiding it to make myself more comfortable today, what is the point, you know? Thank you. 
If you want to go home, it is said you must die. For as the flavor of your spirit changes, its shape and visible chaos, its form burning mist, burning mist, you are compelled to see this through. You're right belonging to this place. You belong to this place. You hold us your soul. We, I put on a, a show recently and, and I got really, really, like, I, I was convinced I was going to quit even before the show. And in the meantime, forgetting all the work I've done and the fact that, you know, I'm, I can actually even sing my own songs and, you know, it all just seemed to go out the window and there was this really great existential pressure um, to succeed and, I, and impress. And it's, I don't know where that comes from, but um, it's partly me, it's partly the whole maybe the industry, I don't know. It's a combination of things, but um, I definitely felt like just throwing in the towel. Cause I was like, nothing is worth this much, you know, um, chaos of the mind. And then I did it and it was fine. <laughs>